In this video, I'll show you how to pull data from any API into Airtable using Data Fetcher. First, add the Data Fetcher extension to your Airtable base from the Marketplace. Sign up for a free account using your email or Google. Once you're logged in, click Create Your First Request. Select Custom as the application type. Next, enter your API endpoint URL. We are using MarketStack's end-of-day endpoint. Now we need to add two parameters. First, add a symbols parameter with the stock tickers you want to track. Second, add your MarketStack API key as the access key parameter. You can get a free key by signing up at marketstack.com. Give your request a descriptive name, like fetch stock prices. Click Save and Run to make the API request. Data Fetcher now shows the response field mapping screen. This is where you choose which fields from the API response to import into Airtable. Click Deselect All, then scroll right to find the fields we need. Select Close and set the field type to Currency. Then scroll to the right and map Name to the existing name field, and add Symbol as a new field. Once you're happy with the field mapping, click Save and Run. Data Fetcher will make the API request and import the data directly into your Airtable base. You should now see the daily closing prices for each stock imported into the table. And that's it. You've just connected Airtable to an external API and imported live data without writing any code. Check out the link in the description for the full written guide, including how to set up automatic scheduling, so your data stays up to date. If you found this helpful, subscribe for more Airtable tutorials.